Well, we're going to sort Ava's dirty, snotty nose out in a moment with the baby nose clear, nose lacerator. As you can see, she's not particularly happy because she's hungry and she can't actually have anything to eat because she can't breathe because um, she's all blocked up. So don't worry, Ava, we're going to sort it out, okay? Put the mouthpiece in your mouth and hold. Then put the bulb end at the baby's nostril and target visible mucus. You can do this one-handed, so the other hand is free to secure and comfort your baby. Then simply suck and the congestion will collect in the sealed chamber behind the filter. The suction can be controlled and you can look through the chamber to see what is happening. It is really quiet and non-invasive. Once the nose is clear, it is really useful to also use the Baby Nose Clear Room Vapour to help keep baby's nose clearer for longer. Again, this is safe to use from birth. So Helen, you've just used the Baby Nose Clear Aspirator. Uh, how did you find it? I found it very good, yeah. I mean, I've just given her a bottle and I've put her down and she's gone off to sleep, no problem. So it's worked. Brilliant, so it's really relieved the congestion, it has, hasn't yes. it? Fantastic, so you've got a few questions for me. So do you want to fire away and I'll, um, I'll ask you? Yeah, from what age can you use it from? It was invented by a lady who had premature triplets, so of course their little noses are very, very tiny. So because it doesn't go into the nose, it can be used from birth and all the way through until they're sort of, you know, two to four years old, which is when they can blow their noses. How long will the aspirator last for? As long as the baby needs it. Um, as I said, when they're about two to four years old, they can start blowing their nose. Um, and so if you can't catch them, um, they can blow into a tissue. Um, so that's how long it lasts, really, as, as long as your baby needs it. Can you suck too hard on it? No. There's, um, it's been developed so you can especially not, there's no way you can possibly suck, so it's completely safe. Um, and obviously it's had so many tests, um, that, so it's safe to use on all ages and it, you can't suck too hard. Do you need to use saline before you use it? Um, usually if the mucus is all kind of runny and tacky, um, it's absolutely fine to just use the aspirator straight away. But sometimes if it's a bit crusty, um, earlier on... Um, Ava's was a little bit crusty. If you can use a few drops of saline then, it sort of softens it, and then you can use the aspirator straight away afterwards, and that will cl help clear it a lot better. When's the best time to use it? Well, obviously, like you've just said, if she's just about due for a feed, um, you can use it then, because obviously that makes um, feeding a lot easier, because when she's trying to drink a bottle and just breathe through yeah. her nose, it just doesn't work. Um, and earlier on, she was kind of gulping, wasn't she, because she couldn't breathe at the same yeah. time. So you can use it just before feed, and obviously when you put her down for bedtime, or even nap times, if you use it then, then she can go to bed and she can breathe through her nose and she won't get all agitated and get all upset because she can't sleep. How do you clean it? Really, really simple. All you need to do is open it up, and the little filter inside, you take that out, and you just wash in warm soapy water, but make sure the filter's nice and dry so the air can come through when you're trying to suck the mucus. Um, and then put it all back together again, and it's ready to go again. So really simple, doesn't need sterilising. Um, and the only reason you would sterilise it if you were using it, say you had twins for example, um, you can uh, sterilise it in between the twins obviously so you're not um, giving the other twin the cold. So that's, that's easy peasy. Remember how awful you feel when you've got a cold and your baby feels exactly the same, if not worse, because they can't help themselves. So remember to give your baby lots more cuddles, try keep into a routine, and use all the Baby Nose Clear products when your baby's going for a nap or when it's bedtime so that your baby has a really, really good night's sleep. And then, of course, sleep is healing and they really, really need their sleep when they're ill. So, sweet dreams, everybody, and I hope everyone gets some sleep. <laughs>